Hello! So, um, just a pre-warning. Don't look my best. Um, but that's fine because, again, this is me. And I like to keep it real. Okay, so, from the title, um, this is a review, a 30-day review on the products called um, Polish Choice Skin Care. Um, it, this was recommended to me by one of my good friends, Allison. She liked it because this lady has, I go down, if you know me, you know I go down these like deep rabbit holes. So this lady, Paula, she has now her own line, but she started this like non-bias called Beauty Web. Um, I'll, I'll put the right name up there if it's wrong. Um, and... Um, she like compares like good products versus bad products and it's really great and so she I guess gives really honest reviews on her stuff and there's just thousands upon thousands of reviews on her stuff and it's all really good I got um, mostly four and a half star to five star products so I'm gonna tell you how much these all cost um, just so you guys know the price um, it, and just know like it's not coming across like braggy or you know anything like that it's, this is literally just telling you um just the basics okay so the first thing i got was next thing is this polished choice um perfect cleansing oil so this is to take off medicine this is to take off makeup um and you can do it on wet or dry skin. Um, and I'm, ooh, that's a lot. That's cool. Um, I'm obsessed with cleansing oils to get off makeup. For me, it just, I don't know, you know how everyone just has their like holy grail of getting off makeup? This is mine. This is the Advanced Replenishing Toner. This toner was $19.20. Next thing I got is this... BHA liquid exfoliant um, and so you use BHA twice a day um, the AHA just once a day that was $23.60 the next I got is this um, advanced smoothing treatment with AHA so that's what that looks like this this one was the cheapest at $19.20 C15 super booster this let's take it out let's take her out okay so c15 boost and it comes with a little dropper um vitamin c is super good and super in right now um, i hate that i literally said super in so right my now first impression like, what does that even mean is super cool. in like mean. it's vitamin Seems c like, of course you know, it's super in it whatever little dropper um and then so this one was the most expensive coming at 39.20 um why it's the most expensive i don't know we'll just pretend it's like super secret powers that make it worth that much the next thing i got was skin recovery super antioxidant this is 28.80 so it's this little bottle, um, it's a serum, and I don't know if you guys have ever used serums, and this does have retinol in it, which is amazing. Um, so you're supposed to use this in the morning and night, um, and since it does have retinol, most of these products do have retinol. Um, wear sunscreen. The next thing I got was the Omega Complex Moisturizer. This was $28. Um, it says it's with chia and flaxseed. I thought that's what you just like needed to consume to be regular. Not to put on your face, but again, this is why we're trying it. Um, this is what the bottle looks like. Um, I like it on the back because it says, I don't know if you can read that and it's backwards. Um, but on the back, it'll tell you what step this is. So this is step five, moisturizer in the PM. Next I got is this Moisture Boost Hydrating Treatment. Um, 
This I'll use in the daytime. I'm going to try this whole step thing to see how it works. And I'll let you know. Um, she did, I did get a bunch of free stuff, um, like little samples. I'm most excited for these cleansing cloths um, because sometimes I hate taking off my makeup and this one's just like fast. Don't you worry, past Ashley, you lost them. Great. Okay, um, so I wanted to do a halfway through check-in. Um, one thing I'm noticing is I feel like this like frown line um, has gone up a lot, so like, not a lot, but like, a marked difference, a mark difference, um, and then my forehead lines look a lot better, I don't know, um, I do keep getting a little bit of, like, minor acne, which I never had before, like, um, I know I started this video with, like, one zit, and I don't have that ever, but I don't know. Maybe that's my new normal. <laughs> um, so, I do have that little zit. Um, I have noticed, like, a little bit more acne, but my skin is dry, and it's not even salt and moisture, so it's not like I'm doing a bad thing. So, and it's hard to know if I would have this anyways, but... I mean, I would say one is not a big deal. I don't know. Oh, another thing I wanted to focus on is my nose. I don't think this is going to show it that well. But I have really, really deep um, nose pores. And, like, just blackheads. That's just, like, my regular skin thing. And I don't know. That's just what I have. Um, so I've noticed that my pores seem to be getting, um, shallower and there's not like blackheads really in them. Like a few, of course, but like not like covered. Skin's gross, right? Hey, um, everyone. I hope you liked, um, this little 30-day experiment that I did. Um, I'm always curious when people recommend me things, if it actually worked and, you know, what their thoughts were. Um, so as you could see by my before and after, it really worked. Um, I didn't notice how well it worked. Um, and so I'm actually really, like happy for myself that I compared it. Um, I think um, some things I would do differently um, would be buy makeup wipes. Um, it really helped what I would do at night um, is uh, I put it all in a caddy and I would have like my little like sponge type of things and put it on like that and it was just like all there all in one space so I couldn't so I just like I could do my skincare routine from bed um, since it's like a lot to do at night um, it was just kind of like I could get it done still be exhausted while laying in bed I don't know like the lazy person's way of doing a long type of night care routine, night daycare routine. I don't know. You got to find what works for you, right? Um, what else, Ollie? Um, so I used just regular wipes. Um, you guys are getting to know that I adore a bargain. And, um, anytime I go to like TJ Maxx, I'm a Max Denista. Uh, Marshalls, anything like that. Um, you know how they have like that whole 
kind of like jumbo place of all like the makeup wipes and stuff I always grab a pack and so um I think when I go to reorder some of the stuff that I'll need um I'll reorder or I'll order a pack of those makeup wipes just to see if they make a difference I don't know if they will but I also didn't think that all of this would make such a big difference um I think the key ingredient um of what really helped is doing all the um mega what do you call it mechanical exfoliants every night um that just really seemed to help I was surprised my skin never felt dry or anything like that I was expecting like um, peeling and flaking and stuff um, but I think because the other all the other stuff is so moisturizing um, it really counteracted that so your girl's a fan I'm such a fan it has all the other things like you can compare it to um, drugstore wise so I'm sure there's other drugstore wise stuff that is super comparable um, and so you could find it for a lot cheaper. Um, I just, I recommend doing it for yourself because as women, I feel like we tend to put ourselves on the back burner no matter what. Um, there's always something else, someone else, um, we should focus on. Um, we just don't think about our skin that often. Um, we're exhausted you know the list goes on and on I think it's now starting to, starting to become more of a thing where we are concerned about our skin um, but I just no 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 um, I just recommend doing it for yourself it's an extra five minutes in the morning and five minutes at night um, but it makes you feel refreshed and like, oh, hey, I'm doing an extra step that makes me feel really, really important and good about myself. And that's okay. And it's something so little and so small. Um, so my final thoughts. Do it. Do it for yourself. Um, I love Paula's Choice. Um, right now I'm going to recommend her, um, put in comments below if you like another skincare, if you want me to try out something else, I'm more than open to it. Um, oh, when I was watching the video, okay, let's just take a minute to reflect on the fact that I said I have a friend and guess where that friend lives? Up in Estes where I live. You know, if you know me, you say like, I, I say like, I don't have a lot of friends up here, which is like true, but like, I have a friend, I have a few friends up here and I have a friend who recommended me something who lives up here. So like, thanks girl. <laughs> I just, I thought I'd point that out and be like positive. <laughs> Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Leave comments, leave private messages for me if you're too embarrassed to leave comments. Um, tell me what you wanna watch, what you wanna see. Um, I'm excited for uh, my video for next week. It's gonna be really goofy, um, informative, and fun. Um, at least in my head, I don't know. That's what it is in my head. And you know what, life is short and you know, I guess that's all it has to be is <laughs> fun in your head. I don't know. I don't know. Have a good week. Thank you. Bye. Oh, the comments I'm going to get about this week's makeup is going to get funny. My ghost came and bronzed and blushed me. Look at this glitter. So, my inner 90s child came out, and also my, um, what do you want to call it? My inner 
2000 rom-com girl came out because guess what it's called? It's called Frost Yourself. And bonus points if you know it. I'm gonna let you know if you know it. Or I'm just gonna tell you. It is from um, How to Lose a Guy in 10 Days. You know, with the jewelry, Frost Yourself. But like, it looks kind of cool, right? I, I don't care. Don't even leave your opinion, because I, I don't really care. Mm -mm. Because guess what? Your opinion, it's none of my business. Mm -mm. And that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and thanks for the love of this sweater. I'm so obsessed, I'm so happy it sold out. Um, this isn't a regular bra, it's like a little bralette underneath. What do we think? I almost think just a regular bra would look cuter. I don't know. Cause it's not like you can see like that it's a bralette. Unless you like pulled it down way low. Who's gonna do that? Nobody's gonna do that. I don't know, somebody might do that. I'm probably not gonna do that. My child might do that. But, I mean, this still doesn't look like a bralette. It looks like a lacy little bra. I don't know. Anyways, if I could still order these, and they have it in like olive, so I was thinking maybe I'll order that for like Christmas. I don't know, it got a really good reception. And I haven't had that on my page for a while. But then it's like, I was gonna, am I gonna overdo it because I do that? I don't know. I don't know. I like these talks. You know what I wanted to try? I wanted to try um, a mukbang. Have you guys heard of a mukbang? It's a thing. Look it up on the internet. I thought it'd be kind of fun. I don't like eating on camera though because then you guys will judge me. But I pulled dead skin off my lip because I've been real sick. <laughs> but I thought it might be kind of fun. Like trying pumpkin spice stuff. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to do with my life, but who's got to know? <laughs> this sweater's so cozy and it's snowing and been watching the Santa Claus like every single night and if Matt's like Ash can we please Ooh. if Matt's like Ash can we please watch a Halloween movie then I'm like oh, of course we can the nightmare before Christmas duh But once that boy goes to sleep, your girl has on the Santa Claus. I have so many Christmas movies. And for some reason, I'm like, I want to watch the Santa Claus. I have like, I have no shame. Where is a hair stuck on my tongue? <sighs> I don't know. But now it's snowing, and it's probably time for pentatonics. I can't wait for Christmas decorations. My tree goes right here. My tree goes up November 1st, y'all. So guess what? Turn off my channel if you don't want to see Christmas that early. Oh, maybe I'm gonna build, maybe I'm gonna make a cute little like Christmas stove. Well, I, Christmas, I have a thing. Just, just, okay, bye. I am on steroids because I was really sick this week. So I'm gonna let you, oh. you guys go now. Okay. Bye. Bye.
bye to all the two people watching. Thanks, love, for your support. <laughs> and thank you to the other person who left this on for background noise and hasn't turned it off. All right. Bye.